All right, Nick, thank you so much. Hey, we have some great food over here. It smells delicious in the studio today. Mekdi with St. George Ethiopian Orthodox <coughs> Church is here with some guests. Who do you have with you today? Hello. Hi. So I am I'm a member of the St. George Ethiopian Orthodox Church. Um, our priest, Malaka Gannet Gassis Sahai uh, Desta is here. Our choir member, uh, Roach, is here. And also our church member, Marta, is here. Thank you guys so much for being here. We have a big celebration coming up. What more can you tell us? Yeah. So in the coming Sunday, uh, we're going to celebrate the Mescal holiday. Okay. And it's a Christian uh, holiday, which is celebrated by the Ethiopian Orthodox Church. And it commemorates uh, the discovery of the True Cross. Right. And what yeah. more can you tell us about the True Cross and this celebration? Celebration. Yeah, so this is the sign of peace and love for all Orthodox Christians, and um, it's basically uh, uh, it's basically um, it's basically based on the uh, belief of that Queen Eleni has seen a revelation in her dreams, and she was told that if sh if she collected wood and do a bonfire, the smoke would basically show her where the exact location of the true cross was buried, and it, sh it is showed so we can commemorate that. Okay, and the big celebration is Sunday. Yeah, the big celebration is Sunday. Where? Um, it's uh, over the at Cascade, Cascade Lake, Lake. Yes. in Rochester at yep. Cascade Lake. You can check it out, and we have some food here. Rook, can you tell us more about the food? Um, so these are all traditional foods. Okay. So, uh, this is called it's, it's like made out of like the meat of like usually cow or goat. Okay. And then this would be like a chicken, like a chicken stew. And what is in here? So it's basically like eggs. Um, oh, those are like, eggs. Yeah, those are. I thought those were potatoes. Okay, those are eggs. <laughs> yeah, those are eggs. Um, some meat in there, and then the sauce is made out of like. Oh, most of it is like uh, pepper, like the pepper powder thing. Okay. And like. Does it have a more. name? Does the dish have a name? Yeah, it's called Dorowet. Okay. Okay. And what do we have here? Uh, this is a shiro, like this is like a really popular dish. And um, in here we we just add like uh, green peppers in here. Okay. To add like a little bit more spice. And this is called, I. it's technically cheese. It's like the cheese and this is like injera where like you would put like all the food on top on of top it. On top of that. Does yeah. that have a name? What is that? Yeah, Anjara. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Okay. And this right here? Uh, it's ambasha. It's like a bread that we like make like on this circular kind of like stove, which is kind of not a stove. Okay. I don't know how to explain that. But it's special, and it's special to Ethiopian culture. And we actually have a very large Ethiopian population in Rochester. I think it's the second largest uh, population within Minnesota yep. here in Rochester. So do you expect a lot of people coming out to the celebration on Sunday? Yeah, we expect. We also invited the mayor and the Rochester Police Department. We also invited all the Ethiopian community and whoever want to join us can join us. Okay, so yeah. any, it's open to anyone. Yeah, it's yeah. open to anyone. And a lot of learning too. People can yep. come out and learn a yeah, little bit more about Ethiopian culture. Yeah, the event starts at 3 actually. Okay. There would be socialization, different drinks and foods, traditional foods. Um, and the ceremony will start at 5 p.m. and it would be uh, prayer, uh, sermons and spiritual songs. Okay, a fun event. All the details on our website, ktdc.com. Again, it's at Cascade Lake. Starts at 3 o'clock on Sunday. Should we dig in? Yep. Is it okay if we eat some of this? Yes. Yeah. Okay, we have to. Nick, okay, can you help me? Rick, can you help me dish yeah, this up how I'm supposed to do it properly? Okay. It, it, dish it up and explain to me what you're doing when you're doing it, okay? okay. <laughs> Nick, if you want to try this, come on over. I can take that. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So you would take the injera. Uh, we usually just roll it up like this. Okay. And then break it in like half. That's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and then you would put it on your platter like this. Okay. And then you can just like take You it. dig in too, you know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> then you can like take from any dish and just put it on. Do you have a favorite? Mm, I don't know. It's probably the dish. Okay. <laughs> so we fill that up. You don't have to put like 
too much. Yeah. Yeah, give me some of the egg. I like that. I thought those were potatoes or eggs. Oh, they're eggs. Yeah. Nice. That sauce looks really good. It's a bit hot. <laughs> like, like spicy? Yeah. Ooh, that's good. That's good. Oh, you like spicy? I do. Anything more while we're dishing up? Anything more that you'd like viewers at home to know? Um, so for the dish, you know, um, the dorawat, if it gets too spicy, that's why you combine it with the cheese. Okay. The cheese. So it can yeah. melt that will it down. Yeah. yeah. Tame it down for us. Yeah. Okay. And then, and then, then the bread is more. like, um, we call it the Ethiopian sweet bread. Okay. Yeah. Sweet Which bread. you would cut. And then you put it with it, and you you can also use the bread to eat. Like okay, well. so that can be kind of my utensil, right? Yeah. <laughs> and lastly, we should mention we have the priest here, yeah. and he's the priest here in Rochester. Yes. Okay. He is. And he will be at the event as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much for being here, all of you. We appreciate yeah. it. Okay, I think we're going to take commercial break to right. dig into this. Sure. <laughs> I look forward to it, though, but it might get a little messy for us. So more details about the big celebration on our website. That's kgtc.com. One more time, what is the name of the celebration? Mescal Holiday. Mes Mescal Holiday. Uh, more details at kgtc.com. All right, we have much more to come here on Midwest.